What's up, guys? It's me, Ransom. Been a while since I've ever done anything showing my face, or even tried streaming Tilu with my face. Oh my god, the low light is terrible. Anyway, I have a few updates with both my channel and playing Tilu and reasons why I don't really upload too many videos about Tilu. I've, well, I work, number one, and number two, I've kind of been getting burned out of Tilu with this whole freaking, like, a lot of the players that now just play online are either the most tryhardy or the most campy, coverty freaking people ever, and it's a little tiresome. A lot of times. So, while I won't stop playing Tilu, I'm probably gonna stop overall making videos about it. Mostly because I'm just I I just play Tilu to freaking pass the time. However, I will still be streaming it every now and then on my channel. But, it's only because I have this package here. Oh crap. I'm waiting for this fucking phone to fall. I recorded this with my phone. It's terrible. So, another reason why I'm no longer really uploading a lot of videos. Mostly... Well, I am not trying to do fucking YouTube as a full-time job or nothing. It's literally just a hobby. Like, I do it in my spare time when I have time. I have tons of videos saved on my fucking PS4 that I'm just... Either I'm too lazy to go through it or I just don't feel like going through it. I don't want to do other things. So, what I'm going to do... As I'm going to unbox the freaking what I have, what I did order, which is like was 150 bucks from Amazon. Well, the main thing anyway. It was like it's three items technically, and it cost me about 180 something dollars, 190 dollars for this box. It's a measly two pound box. So yeah, and then after that. I'm going to show you a current project that me and my roommate, we recently bought that I call our $200 turd. Because it cost us $200 and it is a project and we're going to have a lot of fun doing it. So, yeah. Also, the thing that I do have, of course is something for my computer a number of you guys know or just a number of my friends on playstation know that i have a killer and overpowered freaking gaming pc and i do play on pc but if i'm just trying if i have any like feeling to go try hardy or just anything like that or get competitive i play t -Loop. Most of my games on PC are just casual games that really, they're not really grindy or anything. Well, the forest is a little grindy, but yeah, but most of the games I have on my PC, I'll just play by myself or I'll play with one other person online that I know, but Let's unbox this thing, and then I'll take you to our project, because it seems to have basically, I guess, stopped. It was raining earlier today. I don't know. I just woke up. So, and then, open this, get all this taken care of, and then I'll take you to our project. Alrighty, so, here's the box. Here's some scissors. There's a truck making a loud ass noise. 
You know what? I'm actually going to open up my window for once. For a little extra light. So, let's see if I can't do this one-handed without cutting myself or fucking everything up. Nope, not really. Give me a moment. Alright, now that I've fucking cut the box open and... Table of focus, give myself a little nick. We can open this up. Alrighty, so one item is something that I have needed for my phone is a new screen because this here is another battery and my current phone a lot of people will also know that my gaming PC up there I've built myself and I'm a bit tech savvy and my phone is currently in multiple pieces because I've been having problems with the screen where it was just bugging out constantly I want to freaking actually take off all this blue covering and make this completely see-through because I think that would be kind of cool looking for my phone anyway so that I've needed these two for a while now and I've just recently ordered them so maybe I'll make a video of like a time lapse or something of me putting it back together but now these can go right in there Next is just a 50 foot LAN cable because I cannot stand playing games on fucking Wi Fi. It's absolute garbage. Even though I get 150, 100 or 150 megabits down and like 30 or 50 up, it's fucking just. The latency for me is still fucking night and day between Wi-Fi and fucking Wi-Fi and Ethernet. So, I ordered this because I constantly, and I mean constantly, am swapping my Ethernet cable. Ethernet cable. Back and forth between... Oh shit, if I can get this back in. There we go. Between my PS4, which I took the cover off for better airflow, and my PC for when I play with someone online. So, that I've been need wanting because I'm getting tired of constantly swapping this shit back and forth. And, if I'm gonna start streaming on my PC, which is why I bought the next item. I'm definitely not going to want to use Wi-Fi on either PS4 or my, uh, my computer. So, and lastly, is the big thing that cost me a whole ton of money. It's an Elgato capture card. And, unlike some people that have freaking that... Some people, like, as far as I know, I don't, I don't really know if people like Bojack and Kage or Rage, Rage Ragger, however you say his name, or Black Cobra, freaking a couple of my friends, well, I haven't played with Bojack, I played against him, but... 
I, I am still subscribed to him. I watch his stuff. And I've watched their streams. But, I'm not sure if they use my specific Elgato card. Or if they, because Elgato makes like four different capture cards. Where, I want stuff solely for my computer. So, let me see if I can't one hand this shit. Oh, magic. Fucking dick. And there's tape under the tape. That's fucking terrific. One hand god right here. I'm terrible. There we go. I still can't fucking pull this off. There we go. Now this I got for 150 bucks on Amazon because it's instead of normal like 160 something because it was a return thing or open box or something. Oh, it comes with an HDMI cable. Is that is that an HDMI cable? Oh, there's my bracket. You were supposed to be in that. Oh, we're at. And now, here is the big boy, slash the little boy. There we go. It's not that shabby. So, I'm going to go install this real quick, and I'll be back. One hand install like a fucking beast. So, for those of you who don't know, my gaming PC is, like I said, quite overkill. Well, it's mid range to overkill in terms of the PC freaking community, where it's just a uh, freaking. 8 core Ryzen 7 1700 and a GTX 1070 which is an 8 gig video card with 16 gigs of RAM although I want to upgrade to 32 even though I won't ever really use that much RAM ever it still at least in terms of aesthetics be nice to fill all my RAM slots Alrighty. And I'm going to be taking out this here Wi-Fi card, because it is absolutely terrible at times. No, most of the time, actually. It's absolute garbage. And this... Fuck, I'm an idiot. I need to take off the antenna on the other side. Oh, no, I don't. There we go. Crappy Wi-Fi card. And in comes the Elgato. Because now I have that 50 foot LAN cable. And. Pretty much. I won't fucking need. The actual Wi-Fi card. Because now both my. PS4 and PC will be running. via LAN. Now if I can manage to get the fucking screw on one handed. And not get absolute garbage fucking quality. Okay, that's not going nowhere. I wish I had a back bracket. It kind of annoys me a bit, but Whatever. Grab my freaking panel. That should really clean the dust out of my system. But I'll do that another time. Oh. Throw that down. Put you up. Turn you. So there's at least some fucking light. As I put in, actually, 
probably shouldn't ever really put things like stuffy and fuzzy little shit in your computer case in case the chance of dust becoming conductive and getting on them and shorting something out but I haven't really had any problems with it so now grab my glass panel And there. And there. Alrighty. Now that I'm outside and freaking I've just recently got the capture card working, time to take you guys to the my next project, the $200 turd. And there it is. This here is a 91 Ford Explorer we bought from in West Virginia for 200 bucks. It's an absolute piece of shit. It's an absolute turd. But, it does run. <sighs> and it's a stick. sunk in about $400 or no, $200 total for this thing and that is for a new battery that we now have on that I have bungee in place and clearly and hoses also I had to do some jerry rigging because the fan does not like to spin because we are missing this here relay. I don't know if y'all can see it because I can't. My scooter's terrible. But we're missing that relay. So instead, instead of buying the $20 relay or finding one in the junkyard I decided to go to Walmart I asked Skyler to my roommate what his opinion would be if we just because our entire mission is to completely rice out this car you know do everything wrong so I went to Walmart and I bought a $400 switch and this is our fan controller. If I can fucking. So you turn that on. And I don't know if you can see it. The fan is now spinning. So, fan is now spinning. So, we are here to, we're just gonna rest the fuck out of it. And then, we'll take it to tracks and have fun with it. And when it's done being riced out, then we are going to maybe actually upgrade it. But it's just a fun little project. So. Yeah. 
$200 car that's sole purpose is to be ruined. So yeah. That's about it. This is actually the good side of the car because it's bumper ripped off and destroyed. Someone tried doing body work and did a terrible, terrible job of it. Uh, yeah. It'll be fun. Thinking about getting like stick on hood scoops, stick on vents, get a spoiler for a front wheel drive car because that makes sense. Lower the shit out of it, get a cardboard body kit maybe, or an actual body kit. But yeah. That's the $200 turd. Alrighty. I'm gonna head off, cut this video together, and now you guys know why I'm no longer really uploading stuff on YouTube. So, yeah.